Final Web Design. This is Steve. Hello. Hello, is uh, Daniel available? Yeah, that's me. Hey, Daniel, this is Steve Mingleco with Final Web Design. We received a request for a new website you're building. Yeah, yeah, I'm looking. At, I haven't started yet, but I'm looking to build one, yeah. Okay, I just had a few questions if it's an okay time so I could get you a proposal. Sure. Okay. Yeah. So basically, I see you've com you're, you've linked two websites that are your competitors, uh, yeah. and those are two sites that you currently like, correct? Yes, I, I like some my, a lot of aspects of those sites. Okay, okay. It'll be a similar theme, similar theme design with a very unique um, sort of development aspect to the site that's important to us. Okay, and you currently have like a logo and um, like colors or branding for the business? Yeah, like, I would say the, the logo is going to be done by Friday next week. The mood board and the brand book are going to be done this week. Okay, so you do have those pieces and it's a real LLC or an incorporation? Okay, I just when I when I was looking at these sites, they take credit cards and they take inv they actually do e-commerce, so um, there has to be like a business yeah. bank account. Yeah, yeah, yeah. We have an LLC registered with the state. We're a licensed gold dealer, so we have everything that we need to set up the company. We're okay. Okay, perfect, perfect. So, okay, well, with that said, I mean, the only thing I see here is on the sites, are you going to actually be selling products through the website? Like, are you, I see on both these sites that you yeah. sent. Yeah, yeah, so we're, we're going to be selling uh, pure gold, pure platinum products on the site. We, there's a few unique features that are important that are obviously going to be a major factor in how you quote us. So... Maybe I can share some of those features that are that are sort of uh, unique to how we plan to sell the product. Yes, please. What uh, what are those features specifically? Yeah. So the main thing is this: like, if something, if I let me describe sort of the user experience on the site of what that's going to look like. Okay. Um, so when you go on the site, let's say you're interested in buying a a piece of pure gold jewelry, right? And you want to buy a a two hundred gram bracelet which let's say we would sell that bracelet for $20,000, right, on our site. You would, I want you to be able to see the, um, I want you at the time of purchase to be able to see the value after you purchase the product, for you to have your account where you see your order updates and all that, but in that same account, it's gonna look like an investment portfolio where you're going to see the value of the gold you have. So for that $20,000 piece, minus our design and manufacturing costs, um, you're going to have a total of about $15,000 in gold or 60000 Okay. Let's say fast forward two years from now, you're going to be able to log into your account and see that your piece of gold has gone up or down in value based off of the price of gold on the stock market. So it's gonna look like an investable asset to you. And you're gonna have the opportunity, based on the calculations, to sell that gold back to us at a certain cost. Okay, a percentage of that total value. So the unique features are that you gotta be able to map, you gotta be able to lock in the price of the product, the, of gold at the time that the customer makes the purchase. Okay. You have to be able to run a calculation that determines how much the product has gone up in value based on the price of gold and reflect that in a percentage of change to the client in their account. Um, so those are, those are the unique features that obviously are, are going to take us some, some decent amount of development. Yeah, so that's so the feature I just described with basically locking in the price at the time of purchase, calculating the difference in price as the price of gold goes up based off of the weight of the product, and expressing 
seen that in a percentage change is a feature that does exist out there. And I personally know that it's been programmed. You okay. know, it's had obviously a custom web development done. Right. And I think it was done through WordPress, if I'm not mistaken. Um, they couldn't do it on Webflow. But that's from what I'm aware of. And I know because I, I did this on Wall Street before I went to medical school. And okay. then obviously now I'm starting a business. So I know it can be done because we I've done things similar to this when I worked on Wall Street with another company that did the same thing. Um, they did a custom website and, um, and they obviously like kept track of, you know, something similar with the pressure that was for Morgan. Okay. Yeah, that's that's a little bit unique. Um, I'm gonna have to do a little more research and get back to you. Do you have an idea of what you're expecting this project to cost, or have you had other proposals? Or um, yeah, I'm I'm curious to see where you guys come out at. To be honest with you, um, I think once we once we get all the RFPs, um, we're getting three primarily one. Uh, here in Miami and then a, a few elsewhere. Okay. A few from a company in, in Europe, uh, one from a company in Europe, and then one from a, a company out in the West Coast. Okay. So if um, once we get all the RFPs, I we're gonna share with everybody what what the ranges are and then what our decision is. We'll share that with every company in the business. Okay. So yes, I will share, but not right now. Yeah, because, I mean, we do have some, like, standard-type prices for, like, a standard website or an e-commerce functionality website. You know, if you're going to use WordPress, are you planning on using WordPress for this custom development? From, from what I've heard from, from other, you know, people I've mentored in business who had, like, complicated websites that are e-commerce websites, they told me, that they ended up needing to have it done on WordPress. And the, that's correct. If, if you could do it on Webflow, that's fine. Like, I, I could care less what, what platform you use, as long as it can actually be done. Yeah, I mean, WordPress would, like a thing of it. would probably be the recommendation because it's open source and it can be edited, customized more easily than like a Shopify or a Webflow or one of these corporate structures so yeah. yeah i would recommend if you're trying to do all this wordpress is probably what you're going to want to use to accomplish it yeah uh, yeah exactly um so with that being said i how many products do you see the site having is this hundreds or thousands or tens of thousands I see no, no, no 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 not even hundreds um the maximum number of products we're going to have is probably under 50. Because I'm looking at these other uh, these, these other sites that you provided, and I mean, you can buy everything yeah, from... Yeah, we're not, we're not, yeah, yeah they, have, they have hundreds. Right. We're not doing that. Okay. We're okay. going to have under 50 products total. Okay. Under like what type of categories, like rings or earrings or, I mean, or is it like more... Uh, chains. Bracelets and pendants and rings. Four product categories with a limited amount of products for each category. Okay, okay, perfect. That's that's manageable. Um, all right, well, I think what I can do then is get uh, get some, do a little more research from our conversation, and then I'll send you over a proposal that would break down the costs, the time frame. Uh, the only thing I really have to do a little more research is this um, gold, you know, dashboard. They're, they're going to have to have some type of user login to access that then, correct? Um, yes, just like, just like they would on Shopify, right? Like when they go on there right. and they can check their last order and see what they paid for it and when it ships. They're going to have that same functionality with one key difference. Whether it's done automatically or manually, I could care less. Like if I have to, if we have to, if I have to have somebody manually put in the change in price in gold, but there's a calculation 
that's done that reflects the percentage change on the client's portfolio weekly or once a month, I will have somebody do that. But I would like for it to be done automatic, but if it can't be done automatic because it's too complicated and it has to be done manually, but the calculations are built into the site, we can do that too. Okay. Yep, that should work. Yeah, because that's much easier to do from what I know. Obviously, automated will be easier long term, but for now, for the first, you know, two years of the company, um, you know, obviously, like, we're okay with doing that other format because, you know, the whole business team is, you know, basically, we're, we're all invested in just making this happen. Okay. Or, you know, somebody will pick up the work, yeah. Okay. And are you guys going to have a physical location in Miami, or is this all going to be through the site, or? We're mainly going to be virtual, and then we source our production from the Midwest. Gotcha. Okay. All right, interesting. Well, what I can do then, um, Daniel, is I can kind of review our conversation, try to put together like a ballpark proposal and at least have a document that we can maybe then look at again together once you've had time to review it and see if it looks like something that would work uh, for you and the business and make sure we're on the same page. All right, yeah, sounds good, that's perfect. Great, I will uh, review that over the weekend and I should have that to you by early next week, Monday, um, most likely. Okay, perfect. All right. If you need anything, let us know. Otherwise, I'll, I'll plan on following up. I have your email as... That's right. All right, perfect. I will uh, follow up, Daniel. It was great to speak to you, and uh, I'll follow up by email from here. <laughs> All right, sounds good. All right, take care. Bye. Okay, thank you. Yep. All right, take care.